Welcome everyone back to the Crimson 15 Podcast. I'm your host, Crimson 10. Invitee PCA. Nate 454. Be sure to check us out over on Twitter, at C15 Podcast. Join the discussion over on Discord, link in the description below. And if you're enjoying the videos, be sure to sub, like, share, and hit that bell for notifications. And video game news, I remember a couple days ago, uh, Sony bought out Bungie. But the day before, people were like, who are they going to buy? Is it Konami? Is it Capcom? They can't even buy Nintendo. And I'm on Twitter. I'm like, you guys are so delusional. Delusional. No. First of all, what does Nintendo gain out of that? Nothing. Nothing. Nintendo is in a special little place where they can do whatever they want and they will always be successful. L- listen, They're listen. worth $100 billion. That's more than what Sony's worth altogether. They couldn't buy Nintendo. Even right, they right. To. Nintendo could buy Sony. Yeah, before the other they were around. Oh, and they'll do that. They'll crush Microsoft. Shut the up, you idiot. And also, it makes more sense. I'll end up, it's going to be weird. It makes more sense for Microsoft to buy a Nintendo. Yeah. It really would. And also, they have the money. With Activision's buy, that was ninety. Add another ten billion, and boom, you got yeah, Nintendo. Yeah, you have to. You guys have to realize they have right now in the war chest another ninety billion dollars that Microsoft can buy. They can buy so many companies right now. You don't even realize it. Right. So they announced that, and then the initial reactions were: were, were it, people don't know they know enough about video games, but not enough. Hi, I, I, Halo. You, you know, three, four, three. Microsoft made sure to keep their hands on Halo. Guys, go look at the, uh, the the history of Bungie. Look at the last games they made in the last 10 years. That's Destiny 2 and DLC. That's it. That's it. That's it. Yeah. Nothing and, else. And if you want to go f- even really further back, what, Marathon, uh, Oni, I think is what it's called, those two games, that's it. Well, I think <laughs> I think what, what, the, what they were saying, the only thing that they're buying them so that way they can, they can teach them how yeah. to make a game or like you can build a character. Use, your, level use or... their devs to make other games. Yeah. Right. There's... There's some stuff. That's background, though. Like, there's a lot. That Bungie is the winner in this 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 relationship. Oh, yeah. What does Sony get out of it? Because I think, okay, I guess Destiny's going to be just on PlayStation, but uh, the Witch Queen comes out like in 10 days. Right, right. So I'm like, what are they going to do with that? I mean, I already bought it for Xbox. What the heck's the, going no, on? The thing, and they also said that they're going to be able to put games in any system See, they that's want. What I'm, that's what I'm getting at. Yeah. So I'm like, what are they going to do with that? Like, oh, Destiny's going to stay multi-platform, Destiny 2. Okay, and they say all the way to the end of Destiny 2 because there's two more expansions after this. So basically all the way up to 2025. Right. So we got another two, three years of Destiny 2 on Xbox. Will Destiny 3 be on PlayStation? But we're talking almost 10 years from now. Right. We're talking a long time. And that's just one game. game. Then I guess they're developing a, another game that's supposed to come out in 2025. And they go, that's going to be multi-platform. Okay. Yeah. Um, what about uh, exclusive maps or DLCs? They go, nope, they're not going to do that either. What the hell is Sony getting out of this? They're getting a, maybe a promise of a future game that can get. What a twenty thirty? I guess. Well, not only that, not only that, it's a oh, take that Microsoft. Well, take what? It's stupid. Yeah, it's like no, a little kid thinks like no, that. No one. I, I'm Sony isn't okay. thinking that way. They're, I'm thinking Sony's going to launch their version of Game Pass. And oh, if you buy our version of Game Pass, you won't have to pay for Destiny. You can just get all the DLCs I think for free right. if you get it on. Well, see, that makes sense. But even then, but is, is that, that worth that much money? Right, for four billion dollars. Are people going to buy PS fives just to play Destiny? You know who's gonna mm-hmm. buy uh, an Xbox though? Someone that wants to play freaking Call of Duty. Yeah. That's, that's oh yeah. Sure. You may, I'm sorry. You look at <laughs> Destiny. It's barely not even top ten in video game sales. And I'm not saying that should be everything, but that's a big thing. Call of Duty's number one every what is time. Sony, again, maybe some background stuff about you know making game creation. Maybe they use some of their devs. To make yeah, I could see that. But that's not exciting for us. But remember, you Nate, if you were talking to me about like Hollywood stuff. Yes, uh, Bungie is interested in making movies, so maybe they want to make Destiny movies. And what does shows. that mean to me, the gamer who wants to play Nothing. games? Nothing. But for the, but again, another win for Bungie, not a win for Sony. Yeah, they're 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 seeing like they're getting all the access. What's Sony getting out of yeah, it? Yeah, not, not much. And also, oh, it was I... kind of a small buy. I've. It's weird. It's weird they went for Bungie because I'm like. There's Square Enix. There's Capcom. No. Capcom, there's could, yeah, Capcom would have been sunk because then you that several games. Sega. Okay, that makes sense. And it kind of kind of hinted because didn't they buy the Capcom like Evo thing, right? Yeah, yeah, and they also bought again. They're the ones who made Street Fighter Five or whatever. They're the right. ones who put all yeah, the money. Yeah, and then another thing too, you got to question a lot of Sony buys lately, like Crunchyroll. How's that going to help your video game division? That's what I'm saying. They're, That's they're, just they bran- they branch out to other forms of entertainment. But... They do have music. They do have movies. They yeah. have television. But again, I'm a gamer. I don't care about that. Yeah, episode. Microsoft is focused on gaming. Right, That's right. what they're focused on. They, they learned from their past with Kinect and all those dumb ideas that didn't work Just out. Just make games, 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 games. Right. So, I don't know uh, what, what Sony gets out of this except for some background stuff. And I, I feel kind of like this is your answer to, to, to Activision. Right. Wizard. Yeah. Are you and, kidding me? And, I know. And the, this is like, this would be like a team 
in the, in the uh, you in the first half score forty five points and you have done nothing and you you got a completion for six yards and you're like yeah doing the celebration yeah games. that's how people are not even that. a touchdown the first you just six move yards. the ball you, move you didn't the ball. even get a first down on it <laughs> that, that's how they yeah guys that's not an answer it's almost embarrassing right and also in a weird way too Microsoft can kind of look like the heroes. When they take Blizzard and Activision, if they clean house, oh, look, they're changing the work environment. They are. They, they are going to do all yeah, that. Yeah, so I'm like, it, it's even a more of a bonus. And um, how many games does Blizzard have? So many. How oh, many games have Activision? Activision? So oh, yeah. many that are top titles. Oh, my gosh. But the funny, the funny thing is, it's like Microsoft bought a freaking Ferrari, and then Sony's like, ha-ha, I got a bus pass. You know? it's Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's where we're at. Any other company, I'd have said, yeah, that was a decent move. No, Bunch they didn't yeah. do that. Even, even Sega and at and DLC. Yeah. Technically, the last the last six, seven years, the only thing they've done is make DLC for Destiny 2. That's yeah. it. Nothing else. Bungie no. has done nothing else. No. And I have to admit, when Destiny 2 first came out, it kind of was a dud. The DLC stuff kind of helped make it a little bit better. But if they're a dud again on 3, <coughs> I don't I know. know. I know. But the 3 is going to be so far away from now. I know. So I don't know. I don't uh, think if this is a, is this a base hit. Or did you just not strike out? I, I'm thinking. I'm thinking. This ball is ball. A, a, no. This well, is barely a be. ball. You hit it in the play, but you got it out in the first base. That's what this is. Because yeah, people are expecting I mean, kind of big things. Maybe not Nintendo big. I okay. Mean, this is, the, crazy. the equivalent of it is Microsoft went and hit two grand slams. That's the difference. Yeah, but Bethesda they runs because what would you get? Not even a run. The Fallout series and Elder Scrolls, and then getting this on top of it. I mean, we didn't even talk about Doom. We didn't talk about Doom. Back, Crash Bandicoot. We have look, at the, look at the back catalog, like a game like Hexen. Yeah, they have a bunch of old, uh, the old computer games too. Yeah. Right? Um, we haven't talked about Overwatch. Yeah, which again, uh, not a game that we like to play, but again, is a very popular. It, out there. Crash Bandicoot, pop- Spyro. Is Overwatch more popular than Destiny Two? I don't know. Maybe they're kind of the same. Probably the same. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And that's just one well, game. And, We're not even talking Call of Duty yet. And remember, if people loved it. The only thing that made it tank was because of all the negativity. Microsoft cleans that, that up. They have that, no problem. Not only, not only that, even games that we don't care about, several games like Candy Crush, is huge, guys. That thing makes billions oh, of dollars. Star, Starcraft in uh, yeah. Asia, Asia countries, yeah. huge. So yeah, um, I don't know. Hooray for Sony. I don't, I don't get it. Right. I mean, I like how like some of the fans are being more measured. Like, okay, that's I guess that's something. If they did something, I guess. <laughs> I bought a sandwich. That's good, yeah. Sony. Now go yeah. sit back down. I know, right? <laughs> Let the big boys play, okay? That's in here. Thanks for watching the video. Remember, you can contact us on any of the social media platforms in the description down below. And while you're here, be sure to click on one of the videos over on the right.